Let's go back to the uh, questing hub and uh, see if they are gonna move forward again. I think what's gonna happen is that every single time I turn in like a group of quests, um, like I'm doing right now, um, my my quest group, my little group of, uh, of quest givers is gonna move forward, right? Like kind of what happened at the dark portal. I'm just moving back. Um, but this is definitely a very, very cool zone. Obviously, um, it's very jungly, but it's like a dark sort of jungle, not like the, the pretty night elf sort of jungles that we've seen before. Um, let's see. Let's see what our zone was called. Yeah, we got the Tanan jungle right here. Shadow Moon Valley is the one I'm talking about, which is one of the prettier zones for sure. Like, it's very, very... It feels very, very night elfy, with Tanan jungle being a bit different. Um... Yeah, let's turn in the quests. Let's do a couple more. Um, the Archmage Khadgar. Our allies can only buy us so much time, or can only buy us so much time before the entirety of that Iron Horde is upon our camp. We have to keep moving. I get some trousers out of the frying pan into the woods. Take a breath, then get ready, Rogi Loco. There's not much time to rest. Well done, Rogi Loco. Given they are injured, half starved, and poorly equipped. But there is no blade so sharp as vengeful spirits, no armor so thick as righteous cause. Man, that's beautiful. Did he just give me his own trousers after giving me his, uh, his tomahawk? Wherever he kept that one. Okay, putting up some new trousers. By the light embrace Vengeance for the fallen. I admire your sense of righteousness, Rogi Loco. Even when you or your, your own survival hangs in the balance, you still find time to avenge a grieving widow. Well done, no problemo. It turned out I could actually do that while doing uh, the other quests, so that's the only real reason. Um, you see that altar down there? I think this is an altar? Yeah. Um, there's a magical eye settled at its peak, yep. And I fear our group will not survive if it sees us. Distract the eye, Rogiloko. Cause us commotion. Kill some ritualists, whatever you have to do, just occupy that thing long enough for me to guide the rest of our group past its gates. Godgo looks over its shoulder. Bring that strapping orc with you, the one that's not troll. Where is it? Where's Thrall? I don't even know where he is. Oh, there he is. Come on, Oriak. We gotta distract an eye. You and I against an entire clan? That sounds like my kind of fight. <laughs> He's an orc. The bleeding hollow orcs use savage magic to transform their warriors into hulking berserkers. Wow. With any luck, we will escape before they can complete their transformation ritual. Sweet. Oh my god, this is a bit deep. This is a bit ugh. Hey, what's up, Mr. Eye? The Eye of Killrogue. Oh my god, what is happening here? They seem focused on their ritual. Maybe destroying these blood orbs will get their attention. Okay. Oh my god, it's a bit, a bit gross. Ugh. Ugh. What is this? The Bleeding Hollow Blood Chosen. They are doing some fucked up shit over here. Kilrock's dad, I just whispered me, I can see you. It looks like Godgar and the rest are on the move. Our work is nearly done, champion. We got some stuff to kill, though. Okay, fine. Um, there's one more over here, apparently. Wait. Where's the other blood thing? Um... Am I missing something very obvious here? Hey. Oh, it's right there. How do I get up there? I can't fly. Can I walk up this little ramp? No. Ooh, they're gonna make me search for this. How do I get up there? Ew, okay. So we, they actually ask us to use our brain for once. Whoa. Okay, sweet. Um, yeah, these guys are still following us, so we gotta kill them. The other guy's like, nope, <laughs> not having any of this stuff. Gotta go on. Okay. I will destroy all of your blood ritual or period stuff, sir. Whatever you are. You're like a flying balloon eye. Okay. Run! Wait, are you a fell? Oh my god. Woo! Kill Rogue's Dead Eye, Kill Rogue Dead Eye, Warlord of the Bleeding Hollow. Look what dragged itself through my jungle fresh meat. 
I know what I must do. So I, obviously, you know, they still have to voice act that and I either put it in the game or still need to voice act it. Find Gadgar uh, on the bridge. Okay. So we got we got spotted in the Tanan jungle. We need to get the fuck out of here. Quick, run. We've discovered the bridge. Okay, Archmage Gadgar. There you are, dude. Well done. Well done. He looks concerned. No, we cannot wait for Oriok. He knew what he was getting into. His sacrifice cannot go to waste. We must keep on moving. Wow, that's a bit mean. Wait, I'm only just now getting these abilities? I've already had them. The orcs in this area looks like members of the Shattered Hand Clan. Um, you can tell by looking at their hands. Let's join us with the others. We must find a way out of here. Okay, Katgar, show me the way, sir. At least you didn't give me any more of your clothes or tomahawks or whatever. First we deal with the bridge. Whoa! See, this is awesome. This was never really in World of Warcraft, right? Like, they had some sort of, um, some sort of staged settings where things would obviously, um, things would obviously move around. Um, depending on, uh, on the, on the certain phase that you're in, but this is some high level phasing right here. This is completely different. I won't be able to get in there anymore, right? I can't jump that. So I probably won't be able to get over there unless I like... Either, either walk... No, actually I also destroyed the portals. I probably can't get over there anymore until I get like flying. Which is gonna take quite a while, so we'll see. Anyways, Archmage Khadgar, what is up, sir? We will hold the position for now. We must allow these free prisoners a moment to breathe. It is not an ideal position, and we will be moving again shortly. Sweet. One of the captured Drena is receiving some preferential treatment. Okay, if you can call it that. While others are tied down and tortured, this one is tied to a stake and burned for the orc's amusement. Use this runestone. It should handily deal with the ring of fire that surrounds the Drenae. Okay. And I get then I get a tunic from him. Sweet. Now keep in mind guys, I, I tried touching that <laughs> upon that a little bit earlier, but the um the plus two plus three agility and whatnot that you see right now is obviously nothing if you're playing Mist of Pandaria, but they changed the numbers around. So getting plus three agility is actually you know, it is actually a change. It's not just, you know, plus three and like a uh, five thousand total, right? Like it's it's not very much. Um, but this time around, it is quite a significant boost, so I, I will definitely benefit from that. Thank you very much for your warm wishes, sir. Stay alive, Rogueloka. That's sweet of him. Okay, so apparently there's a Drenne being burned right here for the orc's amusement. Oh my god. That's a bit mean. Come here. I feel the flames dying out. What is happening? We have a visitor. Perhaps a savior. Oh, there's actually two of them. Is there two or one? We are freed, follow me. Yeah, there are two of them, sweet. I will follow you, dude. I will follow you. Was that already the quest? I guess we just needed new characters right here, okay. So we managed to free him, free the shaman as well as um, a warrior or whatever he is. Sweet, and we actually turned in the quest with him. I owe you my life, stranger. I offer you and your company my support. Together, we may make a, make it out of this jungle alive. Okay, I'm gonna wear the tunic that he gives me. Sweet. Am I still showing off my broad chest? I am. There's no there's no model change, but obviously. Oh, I still have my pink mustache, so we got that going. Um, I see you're on your way out of this trap, Rogue Logo, and it's right through the middle of that arena. This might be the end of us. Well, you've been saying that a couple of times already, man. And uh, so far, I have not even been remotely close to dying, so... Katgar, you're a little bit of a drama queen, I gotta be honest. Like, this is a bit bit weird. A combat arena, this may be a trap, but at least we will die with honor. Thrall, you can't say that, dude. You're like one of the most powerful people in the entire game. This slaver and torturer knows nothing of honor. Well, here we go. I think we're gonna have like a big massive fight over here. This is awesome though, this is this has never happened before in World of Warcraft, I don't think. Not at this skill at least. I mean this is kind of like a huge, huge um like a huge huge escort quest. Oh my god, kill a hundred or die trying. Time to kill Shlaf. Okay. I guess we kill stuff. I've activated my AoE stuff, which is useful. Um and I gotta kill a hundred right here. Um which should be doable. Which should be doable. Oh, 
Yeah, it goes actually quite quickly. Just gotta make sure I do some AoE. Hit him a couple of times, then go over to the next one. Shadow step. I gotta say, Rogue is actually really fun to play. I've never really played Rogue, but uh, so far I'm really, really enjoying it. Even though I don't really know exactly what I'm doing, and I'm not using half of my cooldowns. <laughs> but this is cool. Sweet. Okay. So stuff is dying quite quickly. Eighty-five, only a few more. Eighty-nine, ninety. And I have killed a hundred. I am pleased I could watch you rats fight for hours. Sorry, but we don't have that kind of time. Wait, what? What was that? That almost looked like a, a panda right there. That almost looked like a panda. Maybe it just zoomed on his crotch for no apparent reason, though. I'm not completely sure about that. Okay, run, guys. Run, run, run. Don't get distracted. Quickly into the cave before they thaw. Whatever that means. I don't know what thaw means, but... Uh, okay. Quickly into the cave. Where is the cave? I've yet to see a cave. Is this a cave? Oh, yeah, I guess it is somewhat of a cave. It's not really a cave, though. It's more like a house, indeed. Oh, well. I'm here now. Oh, we're blocking it off? Sweet mother of Archmage. This is like the Lord of the Rings all over again. We're in the mines of Moria. Need to watch out. Okay, ready for my turn in. Archmage Katgar, what's up? You're still alive? Good. That cave in will hold them for so long. We have to keep moving. We have, yeah, we'll only hold them for so long. Um, Exarch Meladar, take Kuyina with you and scout that cave, as you wish. Good fortune. Marat, we will protect the wounded prisoners and make sure Cargo doesn't get through the rubble. You go ahead and clear the cave. Okay. What did I actually get as a quest reward there? Oh, I got a helm. Okay. I was like, wait, what is that? Looked like a mount. But okay, cool. Luca, the bad orcs tried to catch me, but I snuck away. I'm good at hiding. All of the bad orcs are bad, but I've remembered the names of the meanest ones, just in case anyone comes to save me. He takes a deep breath. Ungra, Guron, and... Um, Uncova. Will you protect me from them? Okay, so we gotta clear the cave and kill some uh, some big ones. We can do that. We can definitely do that. Sweet. It's not my target. I gotta say, actually, this leeching poison is quite useful. I don't really get ever low in life. Oh. I actually don't have to kill a specific enemy. I can just sort of kill whatever I want, which is cool. Um, so let's sprint along. Uh, I'm gonna just go for the big guys. The big guys are up here. At least one of them is. Looks like everyone's waiting for him to spawn. There he is. Thank you, Blizzard. Uh, I think this is like in the other zones where you actually can kill them all at once. We don't really need to worry. Is that actually? Oh no, I thought it was spawning. It's just a little ability. Do I go through there? What is this? Oh, there we go. Yeah, it does just spawn right here. So I should get the quest reward right now from this as well. Um, no matter what, I should get it. Yep, there we go. So obviously, like in the old game, what would happen a whole lot of times is that you would just have to compete for the kills, which is very frustrating. Um, now, my quest objective still says it's supposed to be over there, but I suppose that's a bit bu bit of a bug. Um, so yeah, so I'm gonna move over right there to the Master of Shadows. Sprinting. Sprinting, sprinting, sprinting. Where should he spawn? Wait, where do I go? Ooh, I can fall through here? Sweet. Okay, so this is where the next one should spawn. 
Who is there? Oh, I'm glad I'm not the only one fighting these monsters. Yiro. Forgive me, I'm a bit flustered. I've never killed anyone before. My name is Iro, and I'm a student for Karabor. You say you have an army with you? The light must truly be watching over me today. I will follow you then lead the way. Oh, so she actually killed them. Oh, okay, so I was supposed to... Oh, that is cool. I thought she was gonna... You know, I was gonna have to fight here as well, but she's already dead. And now we have another one for our group. See, that is new in World of Warcraft. We have yet to see things like that. It used to always be just kill quests, right? And uh, now they give these little tiny changes, which just makes the game... I don't know, not so much... Not so much a lot better, I suppose, but just makes the world feel more alive. Like, when things are... Are less in a set way, if that makes any sense at all. It's quite cool. Let's kill some things, though. Um, yeah, so we just gotta kill stuff. Okay, so she's just going by herself right now, and she's just letting me die. Wow. That's a bit mean now, is it? Uh, so we got nine kills after this one and the doggies are always good the doggies are always good that sounds wrong but I don't care uh, they should finish off my quest and should give me access to turn them all in after killing the very last one actually I'm getting some uh, some bonus wolfies apparently yeah, there we go well at least we killed uh, plenty of them Oh, those are actually spawned by the Ritualist. Okay, that makes sense. Um, so we have one more that is to the left. Yeah. Let's go get it. This is actually a really, really fun zone. I like it. We'll spawn over here. I'm pretty sure it will. Ungra. Taskmaster Gurren. No, I've already been here. I've already been here. Um, we killed this guy earlier. Is Ungra over there? That is Ungra. Where are you, dude? Ungra. Ungra's right there. Somewhere. How do I get there, though? Maybe I should turn in my quest first. Guys, some help, please. <laughs> they don't care. Wow, they literally do not care. Okay, well, I'm gonna turn my quest in, and I'm not sure if it will help me at all, but... Uh, up there it is! Caladan the Breaker! No doubt he's been alerting to our presses, and he's attempting to tell the Warlord against a little jailbreak. We have to take him out. You fight exceptionally well, Rogi Loco. Better than I would have ever hoped to. With those orcs out of the way, Katgar and Marat should now be able to safely guide the rest of the group through the cave. Well, I'm gonna have to kill that very last one as well, though. There's, there's still one quest. Taskmaster Gurren. Um, and he's not over where the quest objective says he is, so... Hmm. Hmm. Where could he be? Where would he be? Probably right at the end of this little cave. If you take a look at the minimap, that's kind of like the place that makes the most sense. Yeah, he should be here over where, over, over here somewhere, I think. I think so. Let's hope he spawns here. Hmm. That's what you get for playing beta. Um, let's read the quest. Yeah, so that, yeah, we already read that. <clears throat> we just have to find Taskmaster Guran. Um, and I'm thinking he's gonna spawn here. That would only make sense, but... Hmm. Well, he's not.
Okay. So we need to search for him. <clears throat> Let me just double check though. It doesn't make much sense. Yeah, we have slain Ungra. There's nothing special over here to kill anymore. Hmm. Where are you going, Mr. Warrior? Do you know where to go? Nope, you don't know where to go either. You're just going back. Um. Maybe it could be one of the in one of those little corners. I'm probably missing something very obvious right here, and I know the people in the comment section are gonna be shouting at me for this. It's like, look, oh my god, how can you not notice this? He's right there. Are you it? Nope. Are you it? Nope. You're not it either. Um, so they've already moved up all the way over to the top bit. Hmm. Oh, oh, he's actually marked on the map. Wow, I'm a genius. I should have seen that like 10 minutes ago, but it's okay. We have found him. Come here, Taskmaster Guran. You're dead, motherfucker. There we go. Boom, eviscerating all of your face. Sweet, we win. Uh, what's his rejuvenation potion? I'm kind of cute. Oh, <gasps> okay, sweet. Um, so I got a rejuvenation potion all the time, right here. Um, oh, it restores health and mana. Oh, sweet. How much health do I have in total? 48k. So that's actually a quarter of health that it heals. That's quite a lot. Quite a lot. Okay. So let's turn in the quest. Master of Shadow. Well done. Be ready to move. We may, uh, we may have had the element of surprise within this cave, but our advantage is fleeting. One of the Nerzul lieutenants remains up ahead. The exit of the cave isn't much further past him. I will go back and tell Gadgar that the cave is clear. We will rendezvous uh, once you've taken care of Kaladan. Upon your this acolyte and I will retrieve the rest of our group. Do everything in your power to stop that orc from opening the portal. Wait, 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 guys. Guys, stop. Guys. Um... How do I get there? He's right there. Oh! That scared the fuck out of me, okay. Jeez, okay.